guys, B-Man here. How are you guys doing today? Today, as you see, we've got an awesome XP exploit glitch for you guys. And guys, this is not going to be only for the DMZ players, because you other players can use this for rank and to level up your weapons and everything. And with today's tutorial, I'm going to make this super easy, so that even non-DMZ players will be able to team up with their buddies and go in and be able to pull this off and use this as a really good xp glitch as you see happening just down here we got crazy nearly 200 x thousand xp just from one game and well you could go on with your team and your whole team could do this too guys you can do this solo like i did or you can go on with a team and make the most of it it's simple it's easy and with that said do me a massive favor get down there smash that like button subscribe if you're not already and let's get straight in and show you guys how to do this now this glitch guys is going to be in almazra and dmz and you will need a bottle of liquor you can find this anywhere or it's common all around Almazar it's even findable in the Koshka complex but you'll find them common in fridges guys so just look around in fridges and you'll find it then come to the complex guys now the complex is these parts here they're marked on the map by the big question marks so in Almazar so you'll be able to see them and come to them now come to this complex entrance that you see me at it is in the middle of the city in the bottom of the car park okay you come make your way to this one and then you'll get to this point of, of the complex and i will show you exactly how to get to the shop really easily now you won't even need to be a high-end dmz player for this i've got the build for this shotgun at the end of this video make this shotgun build and you'll be flying through here one shotting all these level three bosses all you're doing at this point of this part here is going through these little rooms and you're trying to find yourself uh, night vision goggles as you're going through here you'll make your way through here and then at this point don't go right go left okay go this way here and then if you're trying to get to the shop just through this door here is this list right here which actually shows you the shops and what you'll need to have to be able to open the shopkeeper but we're not doing that for this video we're just we don't need to actually open that shop so we don't need to click those up all that we need to do is take our one bottle of liquor to the shop now it's quite easy to get to the shop and straightforward if you take this route that i've took this entrance for the costume complex because it's pretty straightforward and you just have to go through the night area and with this video here i'll show you how to do it from this entrance real quick real easy so pretty much you just got to clear these parts and then you make your way through that corridor we're just looking into to carry on through so you've got this room here you can go through here but once you've done in this room you come through this windows area and you'll come through this same way that you see me going here so i'm just here just checking out because this is where you can find the scientist notes and the sulfur acid which i thought well if i see it as i'm going through i'll pick it up you've got a sentry gun here now if you carry smokes like me you could smoke it or you can just use the things to take cover and this shotgun here as you see it kills it quite easily so again you don't need to be a high skilled person here now this room here if you're not skilled you might have trouble with so this shotgun will be really handy and just take it your time and take them out one at a time and go through here there's quite a few bots that are right here there's about 12 in total but you'll be fine get through here and then once you make your way through here you'll need to have a battery and a pair of jump leads you can find that in these rooms just around here if you don't bring it in so don't panic about that and just in these couple rooms right here you'll be able to find the battery and the jump leads that you need to open your door right here guys so just kill these few things here and be aware of the sentry gun here so if you jump off here you can shoot it from behind and then in these rooms like you see right here this is where i got the night vision goggles and the jumper leads now you also want night vision goggles to be able to see in this next area now don't panic about this next area guys because i've got a way to show you how to get through really easy you're pretty much just going in two straight lines so once you've got your battery and your jumper leads you need that to be able to open this door here come up to here and place them into there now you can press the button to open this door and this point you're going to need your night vision goggles so activate your night vision goggles when you get into here follow what you see me 
come to this and just go straight ahead from here west until you get to this hut here with the light on and then by it will be these vents and there will be a factory admin key in one of these vents by this hut as you see for us it was right here and then from this point of this hut you want to go north so from this hut you want to come over here and go straight north till you get to this point here then you want to jump over these boxes and you want to carry on north okay guys now this is the easiest way to navigate through this area so i highly recommend you just do that and then you're going straight to the shop now it's really easy real simple real easy and if you use a smoke you can smoke out this sentry gun and just kill it easy as now pretty much that's that guys as you've seen there there wasn't much really involved in here as ways of skill or having to kill much so you don't even need to be a high-end dmz player or a top skilled player to be able to do this job right here as you see you just got a couple bots so as long as you can deal with a couple bots you'll be laughing close these two doors here and now you're there now all you need to do is drop that one bottle of liquor into the dead drop right here and then you've glitched it out now anything that you drop into that dead drop will now drop one of these bad books of code and these code books can be sold for a heck load of money at the buy station right next so what you can do is you can get up a lot of them and then just press x to sell them and as you see it'll be instant max money now you can either buy self revives with this which you'll get like 5000 xp which is also weapon xp for the weapon you're holding and then you can dead drop the self revives guys for that crown mission that's dead drop 50 self revives to complete that and then you'll be able to have free self revive starting with every match if you've got that unlocked to be able to do that mission or you can as you see here just buy the restricted l2 zone cards you can buy them way faster and if everything that you drop into the dead drop will give you another one of those shop tabs right so all you do is you drop them in you get those tabs then you sell them to the shop and four of them for me was selling them for two hundred fifty thousand plus buy l2 restricted cards which gives you 5000 xp and that's also weapon xp for whatever weapon you're holding if you're holding want to level up your weapons really fast you can also do that too and then dead drop them get more codes to sell and then press x to sell all get 250 buy your l2 restricted zones get 5000 xp dead drop them to get more codes and rinse and repeat rinse and repeat all game long you and your whole team can be doing this if you want to do it with a team or you can do it solo and guys it's crazy xp crazy xp rank weapon levels and everything guys now get in and do this while you can because this is so game breaking i can guarantee they're gonna patch this fast so with that said get down there for me smash that like button for me subscribe if you're not already share this with all your buddies because hey let everyone know because they're gonna patch this so they might as well make the most of it while they can hey eh, guys with that said once you've got all your xp it's simple as when you're ready to exfil just take this route that you see here to go to the closest exfil it's just right here and you again you don't need skill to exfil right here just here's the elevator exfil and you've got your xp guys Jump back into the next game and do it again. Rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat. Easy as simple as, guys. So with that said, smash that like button for me. Subscribe if you're not already. And of course, share this video with all your friends. Now, so as you see, guys, I'm actually extracting some of those codes too. And as you'll see, they were worth a lot of money extracted. And when I extracted, I successfully extracted with like 600,000 worth of value and extracts as well. So all you need to do is come to the elevators, close the elevators. And then once the elevator door closed, you've extracted successfully, guys. And as you see, there's no real difficulty coming to Koshka, so don't be pushed, put off about the Koshka complex. I've got this build right here that I'm about to show you at the end of this video. So we'll show you the exfil, we'll show you the, the experience we got for this one game, and then we'll go in and I'll show you the build and the tune 
that I use for this, guys. So then you'll be fully set up to go in and smash out DMZ, smash out that, and you don't even need anything for this. You could just take in this one shotgun, as you see, that's all I used. You don't need double insured weapons or anything, guys. And even if you're not a DMZ player, you can get in and you can power level up easy as, simple as, use this to level up your guns, whatever gun you're holding when you buy the buy the stuff from the buy station is the gun that will get the weapon XP guys, simple as, easy as, so with that said, smash that like button for me, subscribe if you're not already, and well, I'll just let the rest of the footage do its talking for it guys, I appreciate you guys watching my videos, and well, have an awesome day guys, B-Man, out, I've got the tune and the two guns and the tunes with them coming up guys, thank you guys for watching my videos and I'll catch you in the next one.